Hello people, how are you today? Hope you're doing well and I'm here with another video. This time it's a new type of video that I haven't done before. Uh, I'm not sure if it's gonna develop into a series or not. Well, let me know if you like it and if I should do more of these. Uh, but basically it's gear review. Um, gear review time. And the first item that I'm gonna review is the Power XT, I think 2.0 by Duotone, an extension. So it's uh, one of those things that before using it, I thought, well, it's gonna be a nice thing, nothing too fancy, but once I switched to Duotone, I was like, okay, I'm gonna switch to the extensions and try them out, see what's the hype about them, didn't have too much expectations. But once I started using it, I actually realized it's the best extension I've ever used, and I would recommend it to pretty much everyone. So let's go into the details and see what makes it so good. Also, besides the reviewing the item, I'm also gonna show you the best way of how to use it, all the tips and tricks, and how to make the most out of it. So, keep watching. By the way, um, this video is not sponsored or anything. I'm the Duotone distributor for Lufania, so I do have some kind of intentions of uh, making it look as good as possible, but I swear I'm gonna keep it an objective opinion and keep it real and give you all the positive and negative sides of the thing so stay tuned so the way you use this thing is first of all you put the extension into the mask as you normally do and then you take these two ropes one running through the cleaty thingy right here and you take them from the top through the pulleys to the bottom and you tension it down with your fingers like that and you push it through the bottom roll over here so you can help with the bottom finger pushing the bottom rope up a little bit and with this one pulling down and over once you have it in you click the handle into the plus mode you take the bottom of the leash away from the this area and you start clicking away that's very nice and easy using two clicks at the time at first, so one, two, one, two, and uh, yeah, it's very nice because you don't have to sit down. Yeah, if the ground is wet, it doesn't matter, you won't get wet, you don't have to think about getting a tool to pull your sail down, and in general it's a lot easier than pulling it the normal way. Once it starts getting a little bit hard, when you get more tension in the sail, use two one click instead of two, so just at the very bottom. And then if it gets really hard for you, then make sure that you're using the whole body to pull the handle instead of using your arm. So put the knee up against the extension right here. The right arm is still holding on the mast or the leash. Take it with the left arm, turn all the way in, and then turn with the body to the left side. And this way you downhaul your sail to as much as you need it. And then once you want to release it, just click the handle into the minus mode, releasing mode, and click away to release all the tension. Once you release most of the tension, you'll notice that the rope is not releasing anymore and you still need to release it more. There are two things you can do. You can release it from the cleat at the bottom, or you can just pull the rope a little bit with your hand, with your right hand, and continue on releasing it via the click system. Then you unhook it, take the rope out, and you're done. Now that I showed you how to use um, this thing, let's talk about the positives and negatives of it. So in my opinion, there are like four big uh, advantages to using this Duotone Power XT um, compared to any other extension. So first of all, physically, it's much easier to downhole it like this compared to pulling it down uh, like normal extension. So that's number one. Second, uh, you don't have to sit down on the ground when you're rigging the sail. And coming from a cold, wet climate, I know that's a big advantage. Because, um, yeah, you don't want to get your ass wet, you don't need to search for something to put under it. And yeah, overall, it's much better. Third benefit is that you don't need any tool 
to download it. So I know some people have these rolling handle things. Some have like a specific handle to pull down on. Others are using various knots to put around the harness hook. Here, you just have this handle and you don't need anything else. Again, one big advantage. And fourth and final one, and the one that is used most by professional riders at PWA is it's really easy to adjust on the go. Either on the beach, if you just came out, came out of the water and you feel that the sail has a little too much downpour, one click, two clicks, and in five seconds you have adjusted uh, what you need. If you want, you can adjust it on the water as well, as you can see now. You just go in, drop the sail, um, release it from MOSFET, adjust it, click it back on, and you're ready to go uh, with an adjustment in less than one minute. So during racing, it's super, super important. There are four huge benefits, in my opinion, compared to any normal extension, but as I said, I'll cover the negatives. So as you can see here, you do have a lot of moving parts. And even though they're made in uh, really, really good quality, moving parts will wear out at some point faster than non-moving parts that's simply a fact um, so basically this thing uh, if you used for i don't know five or more years it will break down quicker than an extension without the handle and without all this um, complex system uh, but yeah i think that's about it so my recommendation would be for everyone to get it easier to downhill, easier to make adjustments. So if you want to tune your sail, that just removes that one pain. All in all, I hope you enjoyed this video. Hope it was useful. And uh, let me know if you'd like to see other gear review videos like this one. Um, if so, let me know what kind of gear I should review. Um, well, of course, it will depend if I have it or have access to it, but yeah, let me know. So that's it for this time. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, make sure you like the video, and ciao!